What is going on everybody, welcome back to Civilization 6 as Egypt on this TSL world map. Now, I kind of cheated a little bit, I was one turn further ahead, and I nearly captured this city, and then Germany got it, in one turn. Now obviously if that happens, theoretically we can't do anything for the rest of the game, because everyone else is too strong. Like that is the sort of inevitable solution answer. I think Rome may even be better than us, it's going to be so difficult to invade them, so we, we need this desperately. So I've got one turn, and I can't get it wrong, because Mali or Egypt will get it. Now I think they'll get it regardless. I've, I'm just questioning, we could leave it if we do nothing, there's a chance. Like if we just pack in as close as we can, the problem is this, I don't know if this core unit could take it by itself. But yeah, the other answer is we like pack in, this Mali unit is not melee, so there's a chance we would survive that basically, and we just sort of don't go for the kill. There's also, what the heck, I had another boat a minute ago. Oh, there it is. Yeah, we just sort of pack in, try and not let them get to within. If we could put a boat here to block this privateer, I think that's the best way to go. And then we just hope, like fingers crossed, Germany doesn't take it. We've blocked Mali off from taking it. And that's like the best we can hope for. We'll see how that works out, because I, I damaged it down to zero, but I couldn't conquer it, basically. I couldn't get in close enough. You, nope, it's not going to make a difference. Okay. Hmm. Well, on that note, I don't really know what to do, then. I, I'm tempted just to throw everything at Rome. See if, it, if, if, if we fail, we just end it, because there's nowhere to go. Like, Phoenicia, Nubia, and Mali have, I, you can't read into it. I think if we look in here, I would guess like two, three, four, like apart from the North American civs, the biggest armies in the world. Like that's probably soldiers. All right, let's leave let's leave all the close ones on there. Okay. Okay, let me do this in my turn. Hang on. Let's just check, because this is obviously an important point. We might just need to bring it to a conclusion. If it's not it's been a rough one, like probably too rough. There's not really much we can do. We can't go after these guys. <laughs> They're ridiculously strong. Phoenicia has one of the biggest armies in the world. Um, the only real answer is Rome. I don't really know where they are. We are 8th, so it's not like we're terrible, but we are very far behind on technology. Like, the UK has a cavalry army. Like that is terrifying. To even We can't even get cores yet. So we must be quite far behind. So um, I'm going to probably just take this episode, let's look at the graphs, see what we can do. Because that city was like, I mean, I don't know, I'm not really sure what that city was going to lead to. But it would like give me a bit of hope that we could do something. So we can't fight Germany again, they're really strong. No one's voting against them either. Not that I could actually vote against them. But yeah, this has gone, this has been a tough series. Um, just really bad. It's kind of, I think it's a very tough spot to start. Obviously the desert tiles are all worthless. I think I didn't work the tiles in Thebes quick enough, which was sort of my contribution to it going badly. But um, yeah, this has just been really rough compared to some of my other games. So let's scroll down. So Carthage will leave on, Germany will lead on, France we keep them, get rid of Mongolia, get rid of Samaria. Uh, Greece is dead anyway, so I don't think it matters that much. Japan off, Poland off, undiscovered. Australia, Mapuche, leave Mali on. Right, get rid of the Aztecs. In the Congo's dead. <laughs> Don't know why they're still on there. There's Rome. Brazil, America, Zulu can stay on, I guess, just to give me a guide. Not that I can. Uh, there's no point even using them. Um, China off. Ottomans, uh, they're not really near us anymore. Arabia can go. We can't get over there. And then Korea, and then us. So soldiers. Just try and highlight who people are here. Nubia is actually below us. Just impressive. Problem is we're allied to them. I assume the Zulu is still fighting them. Um, Carthage is that pink line. So they are... We're up here actually. So they're falling away from us. Or Dido I should say. Phoenicia. Not Carthage. Mali is also that one. Miles in front. Rome is there. Okay we're not doing... Okay Rome is dying. Okay let, let's just go for it. I don't, I don't care at this point. Right Rome. Um, denounce, 
All right, five turns. Let's prepare for this. I'm throwing everything at them. Like, I don't care if someone else invades and finishes it. We need to... Jesus Christ. What the heck? Okay, apparently this is going in four turns. Thanks for telling me. Really, really soon. Why is everything... What? Why is everything 999? Um, okay, well, things are going from bad to worse then. I don't even think there's a way to save that. Like, what the heck? What have France done? They're just suddenly stealing our stuff. I don't want to change. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm just going to go after Rome. I don't care. Okay, I can't move. Whoa, what's going on? There we go. <laughs> just stuck to the mouse. Um, yeah, I'm just going to invade Rome. I, I mean, we're losing this to France, I guess. <laughs> There's nothing I can do there. I'm going to have to make my units run away, so I assume I don't lose them. If I do that, all right. Okay. There's so much annoying things happening right now. I don't really know what to do. <sighs> I'm just going to throw everything at Rome. And if we lose everything, that'll be it. And if we don't take everything... Yeah, if we take everything, we'll try and keep going. Probably just plow straight into France afterwards. See how that goes. But yeah, we've got to do something at this point. It's just getting ridiculous. So let's, let's do it. See how it all works out. But yeah, I don't get how we're losing this. I mean, France must be... Just doing really good with loyalty, I guess. I don't know. But there you go. I don't get how they can st st take it away so easily. Like, it's not like it's that far from our stuff. Um, which really sucks. But whatever. This doesn't make any sense. Like, why was there no warning? I mean, there probably was and I missed it, but... <laughs> sure, that's not been there too long. I'm guessing France just did something or whatever, and it's joint war against England. How am I supposed to do that? <laughs> so these people not think before they make offers. How are you supposed to? All I don't get how I'm doing so well for army. Like Marley has ten times as much stuff as me, and they were only like a little notch above me on the on the graph. That doesn't really make any sense at all. Kind of ridiculous. Oh well. I mean, we could probably justify going after Nubia. The problem is their tech's too good. And I mean, the Zulu are sort of running right in here. But yeah, everyone's technology is too good. I could not really have any success there. I mean, obviously if I could eat, maybe even if I grab this one, then if I just, which is obviously their capital, but then leave them and then maybe just kick Arabia out here, I don't know. There is opportunities, but it's going to be difficult. I mean, Phoenicia's struggling as well. Phoenicia is coastal. Mm. Mm. <laughs> we could grab their capital if we were very effective. <laughs> I don't think it would happen. I'm kind of frustrated about all this open borders. I like the alliance, but it is it looks dreadful. And it makes it very difficult to move. Oh, Marley's attacking Rome. No wonder I can't. No. I might just start. Can you switch? Can I just start playing as Marley? They've basically done everything I wanted to do this entire game. And they're completely in my way the whole time so you know oh we can't go any further around that way so let's come back um yeah i, I don't really know what do we what do we do in this scenario <laughs> there's literally nothing i can i have hardly oh, there's just no space to move mm. <laughs> Get, oh my we can't even move this guy any close are you serious <sighs> <laughs> hmm. Fun, fun, fun. Doing nothing. This alliance better than so I'm not renewing it. I don't care if Marley take us out straight away. I can't live with this. It's so terrible. <laughs> I can't move my. They're using more of my tiles than I am. Like, that is insane. I don't. That's not even over. Under over overestimate or exaggeration. That's true. That is ridiculous. <laughs> if they settle down there as well, just to rub it in, that would be fun. I can't even tell like what's mine. There's just so many things. Just... Ah, I might. I think I'm gonna have to go after Phoenicia instead. I just change my mind. I mean, some of their good units are in the other sea. In theory, shouldn't be able to cross through. I'm sure they can because you know they cheat all the time. But yeah, I'm just gonna go after Phoenicia instead. It's easier. Oh no, I'm allied to them actually. Never mind. I can't do that. Oh, Marley's fighting them as well. Oh, wow, Marley, you really... 
really know how to get in the way of everything. Do you have anything better to do? Get out of my way? I'm at war with the Zulu apparently, I have no idea when that happened. <laughs> just, just saw that. Should I just come down there? Just send all my stuff? I don't think I can take anything off him. He has field cannon armies. I imagine that would one shot most of my units, so I'm not going to go anywhere near that. Yeah, this series has gone pretty poorly. Um, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'm going to leave you guys with a decision to make right now, which is um, comment down below. Do you or yeah? I'll probably forget to put our vote, so I'll leave it. We up to you. Would you like to see me continue? And by continue, I mean throw every unit at Rome in like a barbaric fashion. <laughs> just just throw everything at them, even if they all die and then it falls apart. Or should we just say this has been a disaster? Because obviously I've got to wait for the alliance to end to even get close to Ro Rome at this point. I can only get two boats at a time through. It's going to go horrifically wrong. <laughs> And it's not even a coastal city, so I don't even know what's going to happen. We're going to lose the city of Apu here to France in two turns. Nothing we can really do there, because we're trying to fight for it back. We've missed out on Corinth. I think we can write this off as a disaster. But you guys let me know in the comments. And obviously, if you do want to see me, just keep trying to struggle through and throw things at Rome. We'll do that. If not, we will be. I'll launch a new series in the next spot, which is going to be a normal map again, like the Rome one I did previously. And it will, I think, be as Canada. I think so. There might be another serving contention. I think it's Canada or China. But um, thank you so much for watching. As always, if you have enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. Be sure to subscribe as well if you're new to the channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.